Yes! Once. Sorry, I gotta turn the AC off. Yeah, see, I actually have to turn the AC off or else it'll be really, really loud. So, yeah, it is hot. So, let's do this quick. I like movies. Instead of O N F, it should be O N G because, oh my god! I love to read blogs. This is beautiful! And I like to keep fish. So, yeah, we have something in common. <laughs> this time, we are going to compare the O N F Flat One Plus with the Twin Star. 900s packaging beautiful they even give you this little handle to carry like a briefcase so super legit for the reveal it is expensive this light cost me 4.99 for the pendant version. This is the 36 inch. That is about a couple hundred more than the Twin Star 900S. This is beautiful. Explore a smarter and more fun aquarium experience. Attention to detail, guys. Very nice. Beautiful. Let's take this bad boy out. And before we get to the lights, let's set this on my lap. Probably peripherals right here. Power brick. They also give you hanging strings. It doesn't come with a hanger or a mount, so I purchased that separately. I have spent a little bit more money, but at least they give you wires. And a manual. We all remember what the Twin Star manual looked like. Woo! It's hot! Nice! And again, very important to me, the matte finish on the screen for the LEDs to help disperse the light. And this is kind of like, it's textured a little bit. Can you guys see that? I kind of get it, I dig it. I want to say aluminum, I don't know what this is, I don't care. This has a good amount of weight, just like the Twinstar 900S. It doesn't really matter if it's aluminum, plastic, and they finish with a brush. And the wire is actually knitted. It feels good. It looks good. It reminds me of a MacBook. My favorite part is this. It actually comes with switches. You have on off. Uh, not sure what that is. High, low, go up, go down. And of course, it has a Bluetooth function. So I would have to need to download the app. I'm pretty sure there's a QR code. Yes, there is. You know you're pairing if these two lights are going on at the same time. Call my device, I'll name you later. Brightness, oh, let's flip it around. Yeah, you can see there's plenty of white and yellow lights. No reds or anything else, but those color spectrum are actually in there. Don't look, to, don't look into the light. Don't look into it, it's bright. We're moving up to 6,500 Kelvin. 3,000 Kelvin is a little bit more yellow. This app is also nice because you get to set a timer. You get to set the brightness, the Kelvin value, and the time that you want. X amount of time you want a certain brightness, X amount of time you want a certain uh, Kelvin. And on the light, you also have these options. Yeah, a whole bunch of things you can play with here. I like it. All right, super bright, let's turn this off. And again, this light run hot. I am going to install this, and this little thing just came off. Wow, okay. Snap right back on, okay, cool. But what I'm gonna do now is keep on sweating and put this on the tank. On here, you'll see little dots. These little dots is for these little wires, and in order for us to hang them up, we have to set these up. I want to measure the light, see where these holes lie, then I'll measure it on the tank, mark them off so I know exactly where I put the hangers, and we'll go from there. I like pendants now, only because you can actually clean the tank all around it without moving the light too much. The visible difference is the plus is more on the yellow side, right? Whereas the original ONF Flat 1 is leaning towards the blue side. 
I mean, the original one goes from 6,500 all the way up until 20,500 in terms of color temperature. And in terms of lumen, this is more lumen, more power by a thousand. All the issues I have with Twinstar, the ONF Flat One Plus fixes. It comes with not only just the app where you could adjust the brightness and the color temperature, but you could also set it on a timer and how bright you want it in the morning versus the afternoon, peak time versus nighttime. On top of that, there are switches right on the panel that allows you to switch it off, switch it on, change everything with a touch of a button. And to put the twin star at the same level as this in terms of functionality, you will have to get this controller. It's only 20 bucks, but it is a little bit of a pain to program. And also the other thing is like just a minute detail that's important to me. Then for the twin star, it has red, green, blue, and white LEDs, right? So you see all of the colors. <laughs> now for this, there's literally two types of LEDs, yellow and white and it's a little bit more gentle to the eyes, at least for me. But the deciding factor is how well they perform, how much coverage you have within the tank. The twin star is about four and a quarter inches in terms of how deep the light goes. This thing right here is even deeper. Is five and a quarter. That's literally one inch more light coverage than the Twin Star. Plus, is more power. This is rated at 90 watts. Twin Star is rated at 65 watts. And in terms of lumens, this is 7500. For the Twin Star 900S, it's 5170, which is a weird number. I don't know why they can't just round it off or something. And in terms of life expectancy, this will last you, well, on paper, 50,000 hours versus the Twinstar 900S rated at 30,000 hours. Even though this is rated at more power, I feel like it's not as bright as the Twinstar. I, I, don't, I don't know why. 